Initially, when I first heard about this project, my first thought was, how are we going to work with the actors being that they are not in person, so timing will naturally be off. Um, that was something which, uh, thankfully, wasn't too, as big of an issue as I thought. And uh, thanks to them having their own equipment, um, as mentioned before, it's made the editing process quite easy. So the pauses that they did make during the call whilst recording, thankfully, were able to be edited out of the project. Um, and yeah, it, it came together quite smoothly in the end. I would say it was definitely more of a challenging project simply because we weren't there in person. I think if you're on set, you tend to remember a lot more about what went on. You remember just little things about what happened on each take, um, whether that be how the actors delivered a line or something. It, it makes it easier for you to cut when you're putting a project together in post. Um, we didn't necessarily have that for this project and I think that was one of the more challenging uh, scenarios because we had all filmed in one location and we'd all filmed over Zoom. Um, so uh, previous projects that I've worked on have been in person and so you have those little moments as mentioned before um, which we didn't get with this project but at the end of the day it worked really really well um, and all the actors gave their all in the situation that we had but I think it was it was challenging in that sense but from a technical standpoint it was it was far easier we only had a number of angles a, like a certain number of angles that we had to do um, which what, it wasn't a large number at all and we also had to uh, run audio but other than that it was uh, really really easy to put together. So I found the project online and the thing that attracted me to it was the awkwardness of the situation because I thought it would be quite funny um, and when I read the script during auditions it just flowed so nicely that I thought yes I'd really definitely want to do this. So usually I'm on stage, uh, it's been very different just in the sense that I had to, you know, set up the camera angles with direction um, and the microphone and the lighting. So it was different because instead of just focusing on the acting, you kind of, you had to focus on all aspects of it. So it definitely felt like I was doing more. Um, but yeah, I miss the face-to-face -face interaction, I think, that lots of people have felt in lockdown where you just chat to people over Zoom. This project has led me to do more because I did have such a fun time doing it that I was like, oh, I'd quite like to do some more, you know, lockdown Zoom videos. Um, so yeah, it was a positive experience.